Hello everyone, this is Jim Okrasinski, your instructor for this summer session of English 1102. What I'd like to do right now is provide you a brief orientation video about how this course is organized in Blackboard. For some of you who are current COD students and have some experience with uh, Blackboard, um, you might want to just pay attention that's to let you know exactly how this course is organized and it's pretty much straightforward on the left hand side of the screen you see the course menu and obviously uh, it determines exactly where you're at in the course when you open up blackboard uh, you will land on the announcements page and this is exactly how I will communicate with the class I will send out weekly schedules with a weekly screencast video that you can watch on current happenings what's coming up what's going on what's due that week. Also, I will use it to notify you of any uploads of uh, lecture videos or additional content videos that may be helpful in the course. So you wanna be aware of when I post announcements. Obviously, schedule and due dates, they'll show you exactly where the schedule and the due dates are located. Right now, I don't have anything in these folders because I'm still developing the course for the summer. The syllabus, uh, we'll go through in a second. Uh, yeah, we'll go through in a second, probably in my second video, which is what is an English 1102 course is about. My information here as far as instructor and where to get a hold of me and so forth and so on. I have a grades category here for you. Okay. The main portion here is you can send email and you get the e-resources at the library, but the course is divided up in the weekly modules and this is where you'll do most of your work. The idea here is, is we're going to take you through a week by week progression. Actually, it's going to be like eight weeks. So you'll see as you get into each weekly module what the readings and activities will be. Discussion boards can be clicked on in the unit here, in the weekly module, I should say. Or you can even go directly to the discussion boards and see the discussion boards. Once again, in an online class that is asynchronous, the way to build community amongst all of us, including myself, is through the discussion board activity. And this is a significant portion of your grades. Not only that, this is designed not to be busy work. We don't do busy work. Every discussion board has a purpose that leads towards a successful outcome. So assignment upload section is where you'll un upload the three major assignments for this particular course. And if there is a need for virtual conferences, we will use uh, Blackboard Collaborate to schedule those particular conferences. So it's really a straightforward activity. Like I said, we go to the weekly modules, we click on a module, you can get to the discussion board here. Icebreaker Forum, for example, is the first one. Those of you who are new to uh, Blackboard, you want to always create a thread to post in a discussion board, as the instructions say. Or you can even get to all the discussion boards from the actual discussion board um, button here on the course menu. All right, that should do it for a quick orientation on the organization of Blackboard. Good luck this summer semester.